semifinals, yeah. Look at Bernie. He always sharp. The hair is big ways. The beard's all shaved up, trimmed up, looking good. Varner just looking like a brick house. you got to imagine 2016 is, is going to be probably it for both of these guys. And yep. look to our left, there's your future. Absolutely. Our left would be the number four. And Barnard currently ranked number 18 in the world. Has a world bronze medal in 2011. the Olympic title in 2012. 29 years old. Uh, taking on Bergman, who's 30. Was actually 10th in the Worlds in 2011. And, uh, you know, he went back to the Worlds in 2013 in Budapest. Uh, I think he lost in the quarter. It was, it was his first match, actually, I believe. And, and he was oh, it was his first match. He was first winning match a guy and got pinned. Yeah, got yeah, thrown right at the end. That was crazy. That guy ended up wrestling here on Varner. He's going to put on the shot clock early on in this one. Varner on the shot clock. Guys with the 25 to score. Point's going to go to the one side of the map. Berg with an overhook on the right. And five seconds to go. You know, both guys really upper body kind of guys. You know, of course, Varner likes to pick, you know, heavy with the collar tie, but he, he spends most of the match upper body tie ups, as does Bergman. Yeah. Say he's got kind of have similar styles to his hand. But Bergman more so an underhook kind of guy, Varner the collar tie. Now, what we got? One nothing, Bergman, 30 seconds to go. First period. earlier, but it didn't look like he was choking him or anything. Yeah, Bergman. Varner, Varner bent over, hands on the knees. Well, that's the thing. You know, Varner, typically bigger, stronger than all the guys he wrestles. Mm -hmm. I mean, it, domestically, you know, when he gets up against those guys internationally, that's a different story. Yeah, Johnny's kind of good. But, uh, match. Yes, I know. Bergman, yeah. down, strength for strength. And I think that's, that's the Achilles, you know. But Varner's having a hard time getting his, his tie up, first of all, getting the tie up where he can actually bait for the ankle pick or the knee pick. That's a good job on Bergman's part by keeping a solid motion and getting his hooks. Underhook throw by attempt by Bergman Varner. Won't let it happen. Throws the hips on him and stops the attacks. Varner. He's got to look 
circle in. Kind of like a cradle-ish kind of thing. He was over the arm instead of around the neck, or as opposed to around the neck, not instead of. But very close. Either way, two minutes to go, 205 in the bout. J.D. Bergman up 2-0 over defending Olympic champion Jake Barnes. Yeah, so at this point in the match, you want to see Jake start started to a little bit. And they're trying. Bergman stops and catches double unders. Not sure that a super duck, you know, hiding into Bergman is the most efficient route for Barner. But, uh, you know, his pick's not working. So it's not good. Bergman probably going to be content to hold good position here. Doesn't really need to attack in the last minute 30 of the match. with an underhook. Barner got head position here on the side. Referee stops it, says, let's see smash. We saw, we saw Jake Barner in this position at the World Cup against Iran. Down by two. Under a oh my ago. gosh, like under a minute, under like five okay. seconds under ago. Like five <laughs> seconds ago. And I remember thinking, I'm and he scored the point by waiting and waiting, and he baited it and baited it. And he got the takedown. And he takes an attack again. Bergman again defends. 43 to go. There, Kyle Snyder leading Jaden Cox in your other semifinal. 25 seconds. This is where Barter has to go. It's crunch time. Yes, sir. Definitely know it's capable. Jamie Bergman is going to keep that head down. Stay low. Oh, there it is. Oh, Barter does it again again. Ten seconds to go. Who are we to question this guy? The champion. One more time. Three seconds to go, and that'll do it. Jake Barter has done it once again in the waiting moments of the match. He's going to take Jake it over Barter. here. You're going to give me heart attacks. I keep doing this to me. Last two matches I've called him Jake Barner. He gets taken in the last five seconds. Jeez. Hey. He's crazy the stuff. He impressive. is the man. I mean, you got to give credit to someone who gets stifled for five and a half minutes, and he figures out a way to get it done. Talk about points. Keeping your composure, staying calm, off attack after attack with sloppy right. shot. He just found that one, and he made it work for him. Yeah, misdirection duck. Over there, able to successfully defend the shot. Uh, to Kyle Snyder here with about a minute 17 to go. 